I want to show you a little trick um, on how to cut off the top of one of these spruce wrapped little cheeses. This is a mini Harbison. It's made by the sellers at Jasper Hill. Um, and this one is a, a special edition that they did with a brewing company. But normally you can find mini Harbisons or Harbisons, which are just slightly larger. Um, we even have included them in one of our collections at Shop Boards & Co. Um, what do you do with this? Why is there wood wrapped around it? Well, there's other um, companies that also use the spruce. So let me go ahead and tell you, this is put on there because when this is fully ripe, um, the cheese can get so soft and dippable that it would just fall off. Um, so they use the spruce to give it some integrity, <laughs> and not like personal integrity, like structural integrity. Um, so how would you serve this? So what we like to do, you can do it two ways. If this is maybe just you opening up for a little snack and you're not gonna eat the whole thing, you could cut sort of here in the middle, just down to the wood, and then cut across to that middle part. We're gonna pretend we're having a whole little party here and we're gonna cut across this whole top. Now, you could do it cleanly in one turn. It might take more. You can see I'm just kind of resting the knife along that wood and I'm turning it. And this cheese is really great with lots of different things. And we actually are featuring it in our Hero Cheese Board um, video, which you should definitely check out too. And you can kind of see this pudginess this is, this is just, um, this is not quite room temperature yet. At room temperature, this is going to be dippable. And, um, and if it's not because it comes, you can pick it up at the store and it'll be different levels of ripeness. You can actually make a little um, like tin foil cup for it and just warm it up a little bit and then make it a fondue. But sometimes it's just fully liquid. So thank you for the spruce spark that keeps our little built-in fondue all ready for us. And that's how you cut the top off of a Harbison or any spruce wrapped freestyle cheese.